Cyberbullying is becoming a bigger problem for youth. This year, there have been a number of cases around the country of teenagers committing suicide. State of Events' Justin Mendoza repo reports on this growing and dangerous trend. Justin? Hi, Angela. Over 25% of adolescents and teens have been bullied on a regular basis through their cell phones or the Internet. And in 2010, there have been close to a dozen of cases that resulted in suicide. And experts say the reason for people's bullying may be due to a number of reasons, like social and family issues, as well as power. I spoke to SF State officials who told me what would happen if online harassment were to occur at SF State. There's a new threat online, and it's not a virus. Cyberbullying is when a teenager bullies another teenager electronically. And college officials will not tolerate any type of act. They would receive anything from administrative warning all the way through expulsion. And of course, there's disciplinary probation as well as suspension. Cyberbullying can come in different forms, and you're prone to it if you have a Facebook account, a cell phone, and even a webcam where your privacy may be violated. One case that caught the nation's attention was when Rutgers University student Tyler Clemente committed suicide after his roommate used a webcam, allowing online users to view Clemente's sexual encounter with another man. SF State students say something needs to be done about this form of harassment. There should be some kind of legal recourse that you can take. Donna Cunningham from the Judicial Affairs say SF State will offer help and awareness for the student body. Gail Or Smith from the SF State Police says the campus will take action by investigating the student accounts that were involved and may block the student account being improperly used. California is one of 30 states to have an anti-bullying law that criminalizes campus cyberbullying through suspension or expulsion. Now the ACLU disagrees with this law because this would allow officials uh, to have control over what students do outside of campus. Live in the studio, Justin Mendoza for State of Events. Back to you, Angela.